of the Murray, but quite a different complexion to the weather across the south. There were thunderstorms moving in across Poole first thing this morning, and those storms moved further north, but at the same time disintegrated during the day as they headed north across Wales, the Midlands, and into East Anglia. Now, having said that, we're now seeing some more showers developing, possibly with thunderstorms as well, across there in East Anglia over the past hour or so, and they're set to move northwestwards now across northern England throughout this evening. So we're not out of the woods yet. There could be the odd thunderstorm to come. And also low pressure developing off the southwest of England. That means more showery rain to come across the south, Wales and the Midlands as well in the second half of tonight. In fact, during tomorrow we'll find that band of showery rain with thunderstorms moving across the rest of Scotland and northeast England as we go through the afternoon. So as far as the by-election is concerned, up at Littleborough and Saddleworth tomorrow, I think if you're voting, leave it until later on. That's probably when the brightest, driest weather's likely to be. Really quite a lot of showers around, I would think, up until about mid-afternoon. The temperature not bad at about 22, and that's 72 degrees Fahrenheit. But this evening, lots of hot sunshine to end the day across Scotland. Rather more showers as you come further south across northern England and through the East Midlands into East Anglia especially. Rather a close night to come, a warm night, but turning rather misty in places, 15 or 16 degrees being the minimum temperature. But tomorrow... Pressure continues to leak away, which means there will be more showers on the cars. Quite a cloudy morning, in fact, across much of the south. Showery bursts of rain moving northeastwards as the day goes along. And every indication that there could be the odd crack of thunder, especially across northeast England, northwards up into Scotland come the afternoon. Then some drier, brighter weather following from the southwest for a while. More rain, though, in southern Ireland and Cornwall by evening. Well, temperatures tomorrow not too bad, about 22 to 25 degrees. It'll feel quite sticky, I think, with light winds, generally speaking. But rather breezy through the channel for a time. Maybe the highest temperatures, once again, will be up in the highlands of Scotland, up close to 80 Fahrenheit. Well, then on Friday, we'll find our next batch of rain moving across many parts of the country. Outbreaks of mainly light rain across the south, some heavier rain as you go further north, and again, quite warm and sultry. But once we hit the weekend, it's basically the same story. A mixture of sunshine.